feel like I'm pretty accustomed to night shoots. I've done a lot of them. Um, you feel like a total vampire, but it kind of lends to the work. And um, especially when you're filming something like this with content that's quite dark, it would be weird doing it in the daylight. <laughs> Yay. Let's go dump a body. After my first son was born, he had a quite a difficult birth, and we were worried about him for the first few days, and I had very restless sleep, restless nights, and I was up all night writing, you know, and I could see how close him and my wife were growing together, you know, and I got to thinking, what would a mother do for a son, and how far would she go to protect him, you know, and that's how the idea of the, the script began, you know. she escaped when she was a teenager after she was quite pregnant and then it cuts to eight years later and um, we are here and we are now and, and she's had the kids since Luke hey hi guys oh hi Susan I love doing acting and I love love horror movies I really like horror movies. So when I knew that this is a horror movie, I was like, I gotta try my best. I like playing make believe and experiencing different things, like being evil. Things didn't work out so well for the guy that we just found in there. And we're rolling, we're rolling, rolling, rolling! The way I would describe the plot of Sun is sort of a, a mother and she thinks these people are trying to mess with her. And I play a detective who's trying to help her figure out whether or not it, is it all in her head or people really messing with her. And it weaves in a lot of unexpected places. You can never really guess what, what's, what's going on in a way, you know, which is the... It makes it hard to talk about it in an interview because you're like, how do you describe it? And I'm like, well, I don't want to give it away. Those people were here. All right. Those people were here. It happened. I do not imagine it. I believe you. You do? Yeah. It's going to be freaky. I mean, it, people, it's very unsettling. It'll be scary. I get really sick all the time. And for me to get, well, not sick, I have to eat. Person. I have to eat human flesh. I feel better now. Laura, being the fabulous mother that she is, covers up for him and does the best she can to just be the best mom she can be in each moment. director Ivan Kavanaugh. It's funny because he seems like this kind of chipper Irish guy, but then you read his script and it's like the most effed up stuff you've ever read. You're like, oh my God. Like, And then you look at him and he's like, hi. And you kind of, I don't know, it's weird. Like you're like, Yo, what's going on in that weird little head of his? My skin hurts. You're the same as your honey in the river. Everything hurts. People should have a like a nightmare feel to it. Hopefully they don't just leave the film in the cinema and forget about it. Hopefully the images stay in their mind. I hope it's an unsettling experience, a frightening experience. And most of all, I hope it's a moving film with realistic characters who are pushed to the extreme. Yeah.